Today we're going to take a quick look at the new Balder S from Olight, so stay tuned. Welcome back to the Gear Bunker. Today we're going to be taking a look at a new product from Olight, and it is the new Balder S. This is one of the mid-sized to smaller weapon-mounted light as compared to a full-size light like the Valkyrie here. So I've been looking for a light for my Glock 19, which is my compact carry that uh, I carry about 50% of the time. I also carry the SIG P365XL for concealed carry inside the waistband. But today we're gonna look at a light that is well suited for the Glock 19. And this weapon is clear and safe. Originally, I didn't want a light that would extend past the frame and barrel. I've got an extended barrel on here, but quite frankly, I just wanted a light that would stay within the, fr the frame line here. So when Olight came out with the Balder S, I quickly mounted it up and notice that it has a nice form factor on here below the trigger guard and also inside the frame itself. So this is gonna be a good conceal carry weapon light for the Glock 19. Some of the nice features about the Olight Balder S is its mounting platform. So they include both the Glock rail and also a Picatinny rail if you use a weapon with a Picatinny rail, but it comes shipped with the Glock rail already mounted in there. So you simply line that up, click it in there, and then once it's clicked in, you can actually slide the light along the rail to kind of fine tune where you want those triggers to end up. And for me, it's right about there. So once I have this alignment to my liking, you basically take it back off and you're going to tighten a couple of set screws in here to make sure this no longer slides on that rail. So with the supplied Allen key, I'm going to put a little bit of tension on these two set screws. Now it will not slide on the rail at all and it is ready for a more permanent installation. So once you get it on there, you basically just tighten the QD mount and it is rock steady. The trigger switch for this is ambidextrous. It's mounted on the back of the, the light so you can activate it with either finger, a quick push down and you'll get constant on and then constant off. A push and hold, you'll get a momentary on and then when you release it, it turns off. On the bottom, you have three options to pick from here. Light only, light laser, or laser only. So in light laser mode, you're gonna get 800 lumens of light as well as a green dot. In laser only, obviously you just get the green dot. So, some of the specifics about the Olight Balder S are, it comes with 800 lumen on max, and those maximum lumens are achieved for the first 60 seconds before the light automatically throttles from 800 lumen back down to 300 lumen for the remaining 39 minutes. So keep that in mind and keep the battery topped off at all times. They do include a clever magnetic charging cable that is a USB cable, and this little light right here will turn green when it's fully charged, red when it is charging. So it is easy to keep this proprietary 3.7 volt onboard battery topped off. As you can see, on top of the LED is where the laser emitter is. And that green laser can be adjusted through these two portals right here. This is the left right adjustment and this is the up down adjustment. And since I'm running a red dot and I've already got this zeroed, I basically just walk that green dot onto my red dot as I'm looking through the red dot site at the yardage that I want, which is about between seven and 10 yards. So that's a quick look at the Balder S from Olight. 
Um, it's going to be on sale here very shortly. So hopefully this encourages you to take a look at our website, thegearbunker.com. We also have an affiliate link on our partners page and a discount code for 10% off all non-sale items on the Olight store. That discount code is the gear bunker, all one word. Check us out on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram, and make sure you keep tuning in to get all these veteran gear reviews that you can only get here on the gear bunker. All right, we're in our storage room. We're gonna compare the 600 lumen Valkyrie PL Mini 2 to the new Balder RS. This is 600 lumen and this is 800 lumen. 600 lumen, 800 lumen with the dot. 600, 800.